coming off of last season, do you guys feel like you have the, the pieces in place and a little bit of momentum to really make a jump in the conference this year? Yeah, absolutely. I think this is a year uh, going into the offseason, our slogan was turn the corner. So we've, we've been working hard, and uh, I think this is our year. We've got Donovan, who's obviously a good player, and a couple other guys, but we're really impressed with our role guys. Uh, Marquise Benjamin, Deontay Walker, guys who have been here for uh, – three years with us that have just worked hard. Uh, they don't play their sports, so they've been around. They've kind of developed as leaders. And yeah, I think this is the year. I think we're going to go out and make a move. Obviously, uh, a team is more than just one guy. But offensively, what does Donovan uh, afford you guys the ability to do? Um, well, Don, he's, he's a stud. He's a playmaker. He gets a lot. Uh, he's going to get a lot of carries, and he's going to kind of be, be our workhorse. But uh, like I said, there's other guys out there around him that are going to make that happen. Uh, very, very intrigued with our offensive line. We got three guys in the middle, and uh, Sam Stevens and Nathan Bracer and Marquise Benjamin, who we think are going to be uh, monsters on the O line and really help Donovan open things up. And on the flip side, it gives you some good size on, on the D line as well, especially with uh, Nathan kind of anchoring things in there. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, and, and Nathan, he's, he's, a, he's a freak. I mean, he's a very good football player, uh, very good kid. And he goes, and uh, we're going to move him around a little bit this year, on, put him on the interior a little bit. Out, put them out on the end, so some, but uh, the things we can do with him are going to definitely help us get pressure on the other teams. His recent commitment, do you think that's something that just stands to further motivate him going into the season? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, his goal along when he came in was uh, to be a Division One football player, and that kind of sealed the deal. Now he wants to finish up strong at Southside and uh, leave a good legacy, so I, I, I think that definitely uh, motivates him. You guys don't exactly get to ease your way into your schedule. Uh, looking at those first three, it's Dwanger, Snyder, and Lors. Uh, I guess, do you, do you relish kind of having three tough games like that right out of the gate? Uh, well, it's just one of those things. It kind of is what it is. And like I was telling our kids, uh, the last couple of years, we're just trying to try to be in survival mode and get through those games and go. But th this year, we're going to kind of be on the attack. We, we think we're in the hunt. And we think we can go out and get them. And uh, our, our plan is to win those games this year instead of just survive. So.